happy friday welcome back how have you guys been if you guys are new i would absolutely love if you subscribed i've been on youtube for almost nine years next month it will be nine years and i'm really hoping i can get to 90,000 subscribers after nine long years but <laughs> so if you haven't subscribed, I would totally love if you did. If you are new, I am an operating room nurse, currently working part-time because I'm also homeschooling my kids. My kids have been 100% virtual for months, months, since September, it's December. And it has been very brutal. However, I'm on call this weekend and I live in Wisconsin, so it's gonna snow, which means I'm gonna have to stay at the hospital for a very long time. I'm on call tonight. I'm first call tonight and then all day and all night tomorrow. I'm second call. Something that a lot of people don't understand about call is that it is on top of your FTE. Like, it's not like LCOC, like low census on call where you have low census and you get sent home on call. This is like above and beyond your FTE. For me, it's not like the worst because I've been working part-time, but when I'm working full-time, you can easily work 60 hours, like no problem. So yeah, it's it's not a good time. So I actually don't mind since I'm part-time, I don't mind it other than the fact that my husband is on a business trip right now and my kids are staying with family when I'm at work. So that is a huge bummer. I don't get to see my kids that whole time. Anyway, with all that said, um, I'm gonna work out. I've been super out of the routine. I really don't wanna work out. I'm honestly dreading it. I'm like stalling, obviously by vlogging. Got my pre-workout in, which I honestly might have another scoop because I'm a bad girl like that. Maybe I need one more scoop. This is my favorite pre-workout. It's so good, it tastes like candy. It literally tastes like a watermelon candy. So I'm gonna have one more scoop, which is probably not a good idea. I usually only do two scoops. I think you can do like up to, holy cow, so mild is two scoops, four is moderate, and <laughs> What is that, two, four, six is intense? You know what six sounds like? An MI. I'm gonna go for the half MI. An MI is a heart attack, <laughs> by the way. Myocardial infarction. Don't say I didn't ever teach you nothing. One more scoop. I wasn't gonna vlog today, but I decided, hey, you're gonna be sitting in the hospital for 36 hours, and since tomorrow I'm on second call, day and night, there's a possibility I might have some downtime, so I'm like, you know what? Let's 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 film. It might be chatty. My my thing lately is chatty vlogs. Let me know if you guys are liking the chatty vlogs. Is it a kitty? Where's your brother? Hey, do you need to go outside? You gotta go outside, puppy? No? Okay, fine. Today is day six of my husband being gone. I thought it was gonna be a lot worse than it is. Um the first couple days I missed him a lot, but I mean we were just talking about this last night. We were both super bummed at first, but now we're both into a routine and it's kind of like whatever. I am really stalling working out, holy cow. <laughs> Where's my iPad? I need my iPad, obviously. Hey, Winnie, are you muted? I'm gonna go work out, okay? Probably be up for you to go on specials, okay? Mm-hmm. Okay, because you have specials after this. You're muted. I'm gonna go work out. You probably have specials right after this. I'll be in the basement working out. Okay, I love you. While I take a quick jog, I'd like to introduce the sponsor of today's video, which is Skillshare. Skillshare is an online community where people wanting to learn more and reach their goals go to expand their knowledge in a fun way. You guys know how much I love Skillshare. I've been raving about them for over a year now, and they are one of my favorite ways to watch uh, classes while I'm on the treadmill. I love their app and you can download your classes and take them on the go so you can watch them whenever you want. So the vlog you're actually watching was filmed in December and if you follow me on Instagram you probably know that I'm getting pretty serious about budgeting and currently in the middle of a no-spend January barely surviving. <laughs> I have been working on budgeting and trying out different budgets just to see what works for my family. I found these classes on budgeting and I thought it was really cool because it also talks about the business side of doing freelance work, which is 
kind of what YouTubers do slash can relate to. And I've learned so many different things on Skillshare, like how to create better vlogs, starting your own business, and even how to repot my plants. If you're interested in leveling up this year, you can try a free trial of Skillshare by clicking the link in my description. After the free trial, Skillshare costs less than $10 a month, which, as you'll see in today's video, is approximately one and a half of my lattes from Starbucks. So thank you so much, Skillshare, for sponsoring today's video, and let's get back to the vlog. All right, I am super hungry, so I made myself some really fast food, just some veggies. My lighting is awful. Some veggies and a yakasoba noodle from Costco. Oh my gosh, if you haven't tried them and you have a Costco membership, you need them. You definitely need them in your life. But I was just showering up the girls quick and getting their stuff ready. I have no internet. Can you go brush your teeth, please? Okay. Wendy got kicked out of her meeting because sometimes we have connection issues, so she was just watching TV. <laughs> I don't know why this isn't working all of a sudden. Delilah is... Delilah is in a meeting, so like I know that the internet is working. Please work, please work, please work. Come on, please work. This is the most frustrating part about virtual learning is like technical issues. I really don't have time to deal with this. If I can't get logged in, I'm just not going to because I have so much to do. I need to get the girls where they need to go and then I need to go to work. Go brush your teeth, please. This is so stressful. Anyways, I'm starving, I'm gonna eat. <laughs> oh, I'm so hungry. 9.50, I wanna get the girls between their meetings, so I'm gonna try to leave at like 10.30, so I need to like scarf this food really fast, because I still need to pack their bags. <laughs> Because whenever you're running late, you always, always need gas. That's just the way it goes. All right, have the girls packed up. I still have to go home and shower yet. And I have to be to work in an hour and 45 minutes. I can do this. Okay, I need you guys to help me carry all this stuff, okay? It's the one, the one, the one. Yeah. Back at it again. Um, it's okay, it's just busy. she is. There's my good pa Hey, where are you going? Get back in here. Where do you think you're going? I have literally 24 minutes to be out the door. So I'm going to hop in the shower. <laughs> just, sometimes you just have to laugh because it's just, it's just crazy. Okay. I think I did it. <laughs> the nice thing about my job is I wear a hat. I wear a cloth hat and then I wear a disposable hat over it. So it doesn't matter how my hair looks. The thing that stinks is I was planning on just staying at the hospital, but I forgot and I have a dog. Where's my lunch bag? That is a good question. I'm bringing food anyway. Even though I'm planning on coming home, I also plan that I'm not gonna come home. Put a little hat on, call it a day. Mask, we have to wear masks. As soon as we get in the building, we have to put a mask on. So instead of taking the disposables, I have just been wearing my own. Oh, there's my lunch bag right here. Okay. All right. At least I have a full tank of gas. So I do have that going for me. All right, so it is, what time is it? 20 to 10, just kind of hanging out. I'm first call, so I'm, we just had a trauma come in. So we're waiting to see if uh, it's gonna be surgical or not. So it's kind of hanging out. I really need to go home and let the dog out. We were supposed to do a cranny, but that got canceled. So just kind of waiting on this trauma. <laughs> We'll see.
Good morning, everybody. Did you plan the snow puppy? I ended up staying home last night. I don't know. Hi, baby. I don't know if that was my best idea because it snowed and I got up every hour to look at the snow to see how much it was snowing to make sure that I shouldn't go to work. But I was also too tired to go anywhere. So that was maybe not my best idea, but I'm gonna head to work. I am still on call, uh, but it's gonna snow way more today. So I got up, I look like I got no sleep, but it's fine. Hey puppy, I love you, I gotta go to work, okay? I love you, I love you, good puppy. I had to come home last night to feed this girl. I ended up staying home. All right, doggy, I love you. I gotta go to work. You have a good day. Um, can I just get a venti skinny cinnamon dolce latte with almond milk, please? Sure. Anything else today? Nope, that's it. All right. Awesome. We'll see you up here. Thank you. So the first Starbucks that I went to is like closed all the time and it just stinks. So I'm still completely uncaffeinated. I really need to get some food. I didn't bring any food, which is like a rookie mistake. <laughs> But all I really cared about is coffee right now, so that's what we're doing. The last time I went to Starbucks, the person in front of me bought my coffee. I thought that was so nice, so then I bought the person behind me's coffee. I'm trolling my friend that drunk texted me last night. Hey, how are you today? Oh, I'm very tired. How are you? Definitely fix that. There we go. You have a drink stopper in there? Um, no, I'm gonna chug it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you, appreciate it. You too, thanks. Do I need a stopper? Do bears poop in the woods? Yes, they do, so never mind, that didn't work. All right, do I go to the grocery store and grab food? Yes, Alyssa. You can sit in the parking lot and drink your coffee, but you need you need food. You don't need to jinx the entire flipping OR because you forgot food like a dingus. When I'm on call, I usually stay in a call room. Sometimes I will sleep there, especially if it's snowing, so I pretty much packed for the whole night. Spent a little bit of time editing, but it ended up not being as bad of snow as I thought, so I went and grabbed some coffee with one of my friends, which was much needed. We went to a, a really well socially distanced place, and then I ended up going home, watching The Bachelorette, and really just having like the coziest night ever. I was still on call, but with the snow, I thought I would be able to make it there in time. So I really just try to play it by ear. So I hope you guys really enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to check the link in the description if you would love to try Skillshare for free. Don't forget to click that subscribe button if you liked it. Let me know how your no spend January is going. Like I said, this was filmed in December. I'll see you guys next time.